at Treehouse. My name is Lily Bartlow, and I play the girl in The Most Magnificent Thing. The Most Magnificent Thing is a short film based on a story by Ashley Spires, and I'm going to read a bit to you today. This is a regular girl and her best friend in the whole wide world. They do all kinds of things together. They race, they eat, they explore, they relax. She makes things, he unmakes things. One day, the girl has a wonderful idea. She is going to make the most magnificent thing. She knows just how it'll look. She knows just how it'll work. All she has to do is make it. And she makes things all the time. Easy peasy. First, she hires an assistant. Next, they gather their supplies. They set up somewhere out of the way and get to work. The girl tinkers and hammers and measures while her assistant pounces and growls and chews. When she is finished, she steps back to admire her work. She walks around one side. Her assistant examines the other side. It doesn't look right. Her assistant picks it up and gives it a shake. It doesn't feel right either. They are shocked to discover that the thing isn't magnificent or good. It isn't even kind of sort of okay. It is all wrong. The girl tosses it aside and gives it another go. She smooths and wrenches and fiddles. Her assistant circles and tugs and wags. When she is finished, she stands up and takes a long look at it. Her assistant gives it a nudge with his paw. The thing is still wrong. She decides to try again. The girl saws and glues and adjusts. She stands and examines and stares. She twists and tweaks and fastens. She fixes and straightens and steadies. She tries all different ways to make it better. She makes it square. She makes it round. She gives it legs. She adds antenna. She makes it fuzzy. She makes it long, short, rough, smooth, big, small. One even smells of stinky cheese. But none of them are magnificent. Her hard work attracts a few admirers, but they don't understand. They can't see the magnificent things she has in her mind. She gets mad. The angrier she gets, the faster she works. She smashes pieces into shapes. She jams parts together. She pummels the little bits in. Her hands feel too big to work, and her brain is too full of the not right things. If only the thing would just work. If you want to find out what happens in the rest of the story, make sure you catch The Most Magnificent Thing on Treehouse on the weekend of October 12th and 13th. You can check out the description below or go to treehousetv.com for tune-in times. Oh, and of course, subscribe to Treehouse's YouTube channel for more fun videos.